My name is Alex Jones. Um, this is going to be performing basic um, first aid simulation on a K94 um, shock. So what we would want to do first is essentially just check the capillary refill time to check our perfusion rate, which delayed right now. Um, we would essentially go in and check that out to see, like I said before, with our perfusion rate to make sure that the blood is actually getting back to the body and all the tissues and everything. Um, we would want to listen to the heart rate, the respiratory rate, um, the blood pressure with holding off the femoral artery or the arterial metatarsal or dorsal metatarsal arteries, and um, check and see if we have any sort of uh, deficit between that. And we would want to check the um, the blood pressure to make sure if it, the actual rate or the actual beating of the heart was um, absent, full, or if it was weak or anything like that. So we'll go ahead and take a listen. We'll go ahead and listen to both sides of the heart and go ahead and listen to all nine quadrants, listen to the lungs while I'm doing that. I'm going to feel, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm going to be feeling with my right hand on that femoral artery to make sure that we don't have any deficits. So we'll go ahead and do that. Oh. So I'm doing that with my right hand over here, checking the femoral artery while I'm listening to the heart make sure that we don't have any deficits or anything. So with that finding, I did actually notice that we have um, a little bit of a deficit, so that would be needed to go back to our doctor for and written down in the chart. Um, and we would frequently check the temperature and everything to make sure that we weren't going into a decompensatory state or a compensatory state. Um, you know, if we were unconscious, we would want to keep the head level and keep the patient calm, as calm as we possibly could. Um, due to the shock, we wouldn't want anything to get worse or want him to go into a decompensatory state or anything. Um, I mean, other than that, that is how to do a basic first aid on a shock patient.